Welcome to the Ummah Dilemma. Today I'm here with a very important message for my Palestinian brothers. First of all, I'd like to express the heartfelt sorrow that I feel, like every other Muslim, for the atrocities that you're having to endure. After that, I want to request you to seriously think about the solution to your problem because your opponents are seriously thinking about it. Israel has found a messiah. Joe Biden, in his recent statement, has clearly announced that we're not going to abandon Israel, we're not going to abandon Ukraine. So just imagine the whole Muslim world enveloped in this statement. Now the question is, where is the Muslim Mahdi, the Muslim messiah? If he's not going to appear at this time, then he's never going to appear. And nobody else more than you, my Palestinian brothers, can understand that. You have endured this hardship for 75 years. You've been made fake false promises from the Muslim world. So don't you really think this is the time for the Mahdi and the Messiah to appear? Because if he doesn't appear or if he hasn't appeared already, then he's never going to appear. Then the Mahdi Messiah myth is actually a myth and not reality. But we know that it can't be a myth. It's been promised to the Muslims by the Holy Prophet Muhammad وسلم, that a savior will come in the form of a Messiah and Mahdi. So this is the time when the Messiah should appear or should have appeared. Now one might ask that if he has appeared, why can't he be seen? And it's a very valid question to ask. But let me give you a quick example. We know that mobile phone signals are all around in the air where I'm standing, where you're sitting, listening to me. But we can only catch those signals once we switch our phones on. If we leave them off, the signals will be around, but you won't be able to catch them. Same with satellite television signals. They're in our houses, they're in our homes, they're in our living rooms, but we don't catch them. Our television sets don't catch them until and unless we switch the television set on. So maybe it's about setting ourselves in the mode where we try and identify him. So it's about time, my dear Palestinian brothers, that the Messiah or Mahdi should appear or should have appeared, or we should wake up and try and actively look for him. Because this is the time when the Messiah should be around. But do not live in false hopes. These promises from these so-called Muslim scholars, they're not going to take you anywhere. They've used you. They've misused you. They've abused your cause for their commercial purposes. They're not taking you anywhere. They haven't. 75 years is almost a century, just 25 years short of a century. So we have tangible proof. We have evidence to state. These scholars are not taking you anywhere. Your solution is in finding the Messiah and the Mahdi. So let's wake up, let's get up, and let's find the Mahdi and the Messiah, the only savior for any Muslim on the face of the earth, including my dear Palestinian Muslim brothers. Thank you very much for watching.